Kelly, you guys had a chance to get out there with the boys. Uh, some of them had not skated in a while. How did everybody look out there? Well, it's just fun to see all the guys again. It's been a long time. You, a lot of guys obviously live in different areas and uh, you get everybody together just to have fun. But uh, it was good to see the guys out in the ice. The guys still moving around okay and it's a lot of fun. This event tomorrow, what are you most excited about? Just to get back out there in kind of a competitive atmosphere or what? Well, I, I think it's just more for fun. Uh, the big, big game is Sunday and we're all looking forward to the game on Sunday because uh, Anytime you have a, a Winter Classic, you get to see the likes of uh, Connor McDavid and, and the rest of the Oilers and Winnipeg. they got some great players, and it's going to be exciting to watch on Sunday, and we're looking forward to all watching it. The Oilers and Jets uh, came into the NHL together. They have a lot of history, uh, early history on. Uh, but the rivalry for you, what are some of the moments that stick out in your mind? Uh, I think probably the biggest one would be probably in 1990 when... I think they, what did they have us down uh, three games to none and we come back and won and, or it might have been two best of five but uh, we came back and won and that was probably the, one of the biggest memories against the Jets and, and, the, and the, the old stadium, the arena, it was, um, it was a smaller venue but the, the fans were great and, and they always made sure that place was rocking. For Winnipeg to go through what they did with this franchise and then get a Heritage Classic, what do you think that means to such a great hockey city? Well, Edmonton reminds me a lot of Edmonton. Uh, the people are really passionate about their hockey. They know their hockey, and uh, they live and breathe um, uh, the, their NHL teams, which obviously Oilers and, and the Jets here. And uh, the community really gets behind them and supports them, and, and you see the same thing at Edmonton, and we're seeing it here in Winnipeg.